Hey, what's up everybody? I just wanted to do a quick video showing this dog that I've been grooming for about six months and show you how his skin has changed and why I always say do not shave double-coated dogs. So this, this is Boomer and Boomer used to have like this cheesy, white, nasty stuff all over his skin. And you used to just touch him and he would fall over. He was so itchy. He would just tip over to scratch. And he used to have a big bald spot on the base of his tail. And now his skin feels, it, it's amazing. He doesn't have any skin problems whatsoever anymore. And his fur is like velvet. And he has been coming for a bath every four weeks and a nice blowout to get his undercoat out. And we've been using this eye groom prebiotic shampoo. Um, if you wanna pause, you can buy it on Amazon or from eye groom's website um, if you have a dog with bad skin. But I just want to show how amazing it is and really why you should not ever shave your double-coated dogs. So dogs have um, little muscles in each hair follicle that opens and closes. So when they get hot, um, that muscle opens to let cool air in to help cool themselves. And then when they get um, cold, that muscle closes. So then that way they can help keep their heat in their bodies. So when you are removing their hair, they're not able to properly heat and cool themselves. And that, is obviously a problem for the dog and I know a lot of people think that if you shave their hair that they're gonna be cooler but in fact you're making your dog hotter um, and their hair and their fur protects them against the outside elements like the sun and any dust and anything like that their fur helps to protect them so when you're removing it they have no protection they're just like just out there and exposed to all of the bad things um, that can harm their skin. So just a quick lesson from me and Boomer.